mutation is a rocking, swaying, or nodding motion in the axis of rotation of a largely axially symmetric object, such as a gyroscope, planet, or bullet in flight, or as an intended behavior of a mechanism. In an appropriate reference frame it can be defined as a change in the second Euler angle. If it is not caused by forces external to the body, it is called free mutation or Euler mutation. A pure mutation is a movement of a rotational axis such that the first Euler angle is constant. In spacecraft dynamics, precession is sometimes referred to as mutation. Rigid body. If a top is set at a tilt on a horizontal surface and spun rapidly, its rotational axis starts processing about the vertical. After a short interval, the top settles into a motion in which each point on its rotation axis follows a circular path. The vertical force of gravity produces a horizontal torque about the point of contact with the surface. The top rotates in the direction of this torque with an angular velocity I copyright such that at any moment, where L is the instantaneous angular momentum of the top. Initially, however, there is no precession, and the top falls straight downward. This gives rise to an imbalance in torques that starts the precession. In falling, the top overshoots the level at which it would process steadily and then oscillates about this level. This oscillation is called mutation. If the motion is damped, the oscillations will die down until the motion is a steady precession. A physics of mutation in tops and gyroscopes can be explored using the model of a heavy symmetrical top with its tip fixed. Initially, the effect of friction is ignored. The motion of the top can be described by three Euler angles, the tilt angle I between the symmetry axis of the top and the vertical, the azimuth I of the top about the vertical, and the rotation angle I of the top about its own axis. Thus, Precession is the change in I and mutation is the change in I. If the top has mass m and its center of mass is at a distance l from the pivot point, its gravitational potential relative to the plane of the support is. In a coordinate system where the z-axis is the axis of symmetry, the top has angular velocities I per mil 1, a euro I per mil 2, a euro I per mil 3 and moments of inertia I1, a euro I2, a euro I3 about the x, y and z-axis. The kinetic energy is. In terms of the Euler angles, this is. If the Euler or Euro Lagrange equations are solved for this system, it is found that the motion depends on two constants A and B. The rate of precession is related to the tilt by. The tilt is determined by a differential equation for U equals cos a Euro she of the form where f is a cubic polynomial that depends on parameters a and b as well as constants that are related to the energy in the gravitational torque. The roots of f are cosines of the angles at which the rate of change of i is zero. One of these is not related to a physical angle. The other two determine the upper and lower bounds on the tilt angle, between which the gyroscope oscillates. Astronomy the mutation of a planet happens because of gravitational attraction of other bodies that cause the precession of the equinoxes to vary over time so that the speed of precession is not constant. The mutation of the axis of the Earth was discovered in 1728 by the British astronomer James Bradley, but this mutation was not explained in detail until 20 years later. Because the dynamic motions of the planets are so well known, their mutations can be calculated to within arcseconds over periods of many decades. There is another disturbance of the Earth's rotation called polar motion that can be estimated for only a few months into the future because it is influenced by rapidly and unpredictably varying things such as ocean currents, wind systems, and hypothesized motions in the liquid nickel iron outer core of the Earth. Values of mutations are usually divided into components parallel and perpendicular to the ecliptic. The component that works along the ecliptic is known as the mutation in longitude. The component perpendicular to the ecliptic is known as the mutation in obliquity. Celestial coordinate systems are based on an equator, and equinox, which means a great circle in the sky that is the projection of the Earth's equator outwards, and a line, the vernal equinox intersecting that circle which determines the starting point for measurement of right ascension. These items are affected both by precession of the equinoxes and mutation, and thus depend on the theories applied to precession and mutation, 
and on the date used as a reference date for the coordinate system. In simpler terms, mutation values are important in observation from Earth for calculating the apparent positions of astronomical objects. Earth Mutation makes a small change to the angle at which the Earth tilts with respect to the Sun, changing the location of the major circles of latitude that are defined by the Earth's tilt. In the case of the Earth, the principal sources of tidal force are the Sun and Moon, which continuously change location relative to each other and thus cause mutation in Earth's axis. The largest component of Earth's mutation has a period of 18.6 years the same as that of the precession of the Moon's orbital nodes. However, there are other significant periodical terms that must be calculated depending on the desired accuracy of the result. A mathematical description that represents mutation is called a theory of mutation. In the theory, parameters are adjusted in a more or less ad hoc method to obtain the best fit to data. Simple rigid body dynamics do not give the best theory. One has to account for deformations of the Earth, including mantle inelasticity and changes in the Coria Euro mantle boundary. The principal term of mutation is due to the regression of the Moon's nodal line and has the same period of 6798 days. It reaches plus or minus 17 a euro cubed in longitude and 9 a euro cubed in obliquity. All other terms are much smaller. The next largest, with a period of 183 days, has amplitudes 1.3 a euro cubed and 0 0.6 a euro cubed respectively. The periods of all terms larger than 0 0.0001 a euro cubed lie between 5.5 and 6798 days. For some reason they seem to avoid the range from 34.8 to 91 days, so it is customary to split the mutation into long period and short period terms. The long period terms are calculated and mentioned in the almanacs, while the additional correction due to the short period terms is usually taken from a table. In popular culture, in the movie The Day the Earth Caught Fire, the near simultaneous detonation of two super hydrogen bombs near the poles causes a change in the Earth's mutation, as well as an 11 degree shift in the axis of rotation and a change in the Earth's orbit around the Sun. The verb to mutate was used by MIT physicist Peter Fisher on the television show Late Night with Conan O'Brien on February 8, 2008. Fisher used the term to describe the motion of a spinning ring as it began to slow down and wobble. See also, Libration, References, A. B. Lowry, William. Fundamentals of Geophysics. Cambridge, UA. Cambridge University. Press PPA 58 to Euro 59. ISBN A 9780521675963A, Castin, N. Jeremy. Paley, Derek A. Engineering Dynamics A Comprehensive Introduction. Princeton, New Jersey Princeton University Press PPA 526 a Euro 527. ISBN A 9780691135962 Feynman, Feynman, Leighton and Sands 2011, PPA 20 Euro 7, Goldstein 1980, PA 220, Goldstein 1980, PA 217, Goldstein 1980, PPA 213 Euro 217, Robert E. Bradley the Nodding Sphere and the Bird's Beak, De Lambert's Dispute with Euler. The MAA Mathematical Sciences Digital Library. Mathematical Association of America. Retrieved April 21, 2014 a, Resolution 83 on Non-Rigid Earth Nutation Theory. International Earth Rotation and Reference Systems Service. Federal Agency for Cartography and Geodesy April 2, 2009. Retrieved August 6, 2012. A further reading.